Coming from that pretty mouth, the truth is fitting. Cause you ain't never talking loud and you know plenty. You know what I'm talking about, cause you just get me. Yeah, you so pretty. If everything is dipped in gold, then baby, it will never grow. Baby, you don't know what you do to me Between me and you, I feel like chemistry I won't let no one come and take your place Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced So go now, there's nothing to do That's why I'm not spend my life with you I wanna please you any way I can I wanna share my world, don't you understand? Hey you guys, we just walked in the mall. We're about to probably stop at Primark and see what we can find. So let's go.
Hey, Dom Loves. Today is March 29th. It's 12.59. And I just want to say good afternoon. This is three days later prior to when me and the girls went out to get our nails done at the nullery. And we also went to the mall. And you guys, let me tell you about this nullery. So I found this nullery on TikTok. And me and my girls thought they was gonna be a good place to go to try somewhere different to get our nails done. So boom, we go, we get our nails done. Me and the girls liked our nails. So next you know, within the next day, my daughter nails started chipping off. One by one, like every couple minutes each day it was chipping off. And I'm just saying to myself like, are you serious? Like how is her nail chipping off literally like the next day after it just got done? It pissed me off because it's like, I paid $15 for her nails to get done and that's for my four year old, uh, Malaya. Lamia nails was still on, that's my nine year old for the ones that are new. The thing is, is that her nails is lasting, thank God. Mine's is lasting, thank God. But, what I will say is my toes, my one of my big toe, is not lasting. It chipped a little bit. And moral of the story, you guys, I'm not going back. And it's crazy because you would think you could trust people on TikTok to give you good places to go at times. But it's like a give and take with TikTok. And the person that I seen that did go to that nullery that me and my kids went to, she told me it was a 10 out, well, not me, but she said it was a 10 out of 10. To me, they are a zero out of zero because ain't no way people nails is chipping off the next day after they leave the shop. So, I don't know guys, like, I'm very, very picky when it comes to certain nulleries. Um, I just don't like the fact that I paid damn near $143 and that was for me and my daughters all together for it to come out to look like it never was done so yeah so i'm just not gonna go back there like i said and i'm just gonna go back to the nullery that i'm used to going to it's a little bit distance of where i live but i'd rather go somewhere where i know i had good service i was never really like you know having no issues and nothing like that with them so i'ma just go where i feel like the service is well you know good and stuff and that'll be that with that little rant about the nullery but you guys more of this video is i wanted to show you guys what i got from um the mall forever 21 and from primark and I'm trying to think which one I'm going to start with first. I think I'm going to start with Primark Bay first. So, this is the stuff that we had got, you guys, from Primark. I had got this shirt for Malaya. I had found this set, you guys, for me. It's like a loungewear set you can wear in the house. I guess you can wear it out to run errands. And it was $10.00 clearance so that was good for me as I never really like wore any loungewear from Primark anyway so that was like my first time and then I filmed this one for myself as well another loungewear set can't wait to wear them um I found this shirt also for myself to wear around the house because lord knows I need some new um like sleepwear for the house, loungewear or whatever. I found this for Malaya as well. It was three tights that came together for the springtime. Um, I found these ones as well for her. These was really, really cute. Gave me spring, real like breathable. And it does have shorts inside of here because when I first bought them oh excuse me y'all oh excuse me 
when I first bought them, I didn't even notice that the shorts was inside of here. So yeah, I'm glad that it, you know, is not like fully blown see-through where you can see like, you know, through her clothes or whatever. And I got this shirt for her. And she sure did help me pick some of her stuff out because she's getting bigger now. Um, I bought this for the baby, Micaiah, the one-year-old. I found that for her. And I found these pants to go with that Mickey Mouse shirt for Micaiah as well. And I also found this shirt for... Yeah, this is for my um, Malaya as well. Um, I found these little bras for my nine-year-old Lamia. She also picked out these ones as well. And this shirt for Malaya. She picked this out. And that was it with Primark. And then I had stopped at this um what is it? What is it called? The um like the piercing, you know, the little piercing booth thing that they be having the little stands. And I found these earrings at the stand. Really, really cute. Hope you guys can see that. Really, really cute. And as if you guys been like noticing, I don't know if you guys been noticing. Um, I haven't been having no earrings in my ears for a while because I didn't have any. Um, the last pair I had, I lost. So I just said I wasn't gonna just buy a pair of earrings from any old wear. Like I wanted it to be at least a nice little good little jewelry um place or like i said a little stand that i know that sells like sterling silver or sterling sterling gold or whatever <clears throat> and i just happened to find them on the way out the mall so yeah i'm hoping and praying that these don't mess with my ears so we'll see how they you know over time do my ears and that will be that with primark and then I have this stuff, you guys, from Forever 21. So I found this. Me and um, Mia found these for her. Some light blue jeans. They was only twenty dollars. And um, Primark. I meant Primark. I meant Forever 21. And we found these ones as well. really cute it was twenty dollars and y'all this jacket I found in here was bomb for myself like this was so cute because I'll be trying to switch up my style a little bit <clears throat> try different stuff this is how it look but I'm about to try it on so y'all can really see how it look on me. All right, you guys. So this is how the jacket look. Don't mind my shoes, my Crocs, and my outfit because I'm in the house chilling today. It's one of those days where I'm just relaxing. So don't be coming for me, y'all. <laughs> but yeah, this is how it look. It's a tie. You can wear it down if you want. And yep, got the little button right here on the side, if you can see, button, but yeah, it's really cute, buttons all the way down, I could button it up if I want, you know, and it's long, really cute, but I feel like I'm going to pretty much just wear it is is out in the open when i do wear this jacket so yep and this jacket was only 54 dollars 
and I believe this was like a, a, a like a sale because it was on like one of those clearance racks for 50% off so yeah I looked up and it was the last ones and I got this in the size small so for you girlies that do like to shop at um what's this what's the store forever 21 I suggest you go in there girl because they are having a 50% off store sale I guess it's like a spring sale I'm not sure but they definitely has a lot of couple sales going on so yeah you girls all right so the last thing I wanted to show you that came in a forever 21 bag was this um headband for when I wash my face I thought this was really really cute I only own I believe like three because I gave one to my daughter so yeah this is my third one now and I'm definitely going to be racking up on more because I'm falling in love with these and I do want to get like the the uh the, the wristbands also to help the water from running down my arms when I do wash my face and yep that was it for my forever 21 haul and my primar haul and I do just want to show you guys um this uh hold on let me go get it so you guys this is what i wanted to show you this is what i'm about to put in the bathroom today after we go downstairs in the bathroom i have purchased this from ross um maybe probably like a week or two three weeks ago it's been a little time but i held on to it because i wanted to put this up on video with you guys and it was only $16.99 if you can see the price. Uh, it's a three-tier uh, pole caddy. It's really cute. Um, I feel like this would be better to um, put in a bathroom to hang body washes and, you know, soap or whatever, shampoo, whatever. Versus the one that goes on the shower, over the shower head. Because that tends to lean when you put heavy stuff on there so i feel like this would be a, a lot bit um better in the bathroom in my opinion and i did wanted to show you guys one last thing i wanted to show you guys the room how it looks now so i never got a chance to tell y'all about this lamp now that was switched before it here was a black one that was right here it got switched to that. We now have the gold mirror here. Because remember, it was a black one here before. And I ended up giving it to Marvin, my son. And we ended up mounting the TV on this wall right here. Um, We still didn't, like, move this part out yet. Excuse the clothes. It's in a dirty clothes. Um yeah the shelf that i was telling you guys about as well we ended up um putting clear bins up there and one is at the bottom for his shelf but that's what i did with that because i told y'all guys in the last video that it was cluttered and i wanted to do something with it so that's what i came up with and we ended up putting this clock here because this wall was empty before and this clock, you guys, if you wanted to know, it also came from Target. The bins came from Target as well. Uh, I also put a bin here because before it was bins here and I put like all my stuff in here. Like this is all my beauty stuff that went in here. And this is like my hats and um, my uh, fanny pack couldn't even get the name together <laughs> but like all my knickknack books and stuff is in here and yep and we ended up putting this here the design the wall because right here before it said family and we switched it out and put it here for this decoration and also they came from target as well no i'm lying they didn't come from target this came from home goods you guys if you guys was interested in knowing where these came from and this picture here also came from Home Goods. I fell in love with this one the most because I felt like it was more of a standout picture. And I'm hoping to find more pictures 
to you know make it look a little bit more homey still but if not that's fine and we still just have this dresser here the mirror it hasn't getting changed to the color that we wanted but hopefully it does because i'm just waiting on him to figure out if he's gonna paint it black or if he wanted to get a whole new um dresser in here but who knows what he's gonna do i'm not sure so yeah y'all that's pretty much what's going on in the room we've been fixing it up getting it together little by little so i mean it feel way better than what it was before i could tell y'all that so i'm about to take you guys downstairs and um we're going to try to put this um pole together for the bathroom and hold up i'm losing light there we go um i'm gonna try to put this pole together downstairs in the in the um, bathroom and yeah i'll see y'all in the bathroom <laughs> All right, you guys, so I'm done putting it together and putting everything on. This is what it looks like. Hey, you guys, Easter Sunday. Happy Easter to you guys. And I'm about to put the basket together for the children. They woke up this morning. I was trying to surprise them, but they woke up, so that's okay. And, yeah, that's what I'm about to do now. I had woke up and took a shower, got myself together because my cycle is on, you guys. TMI, sorry. But, yeah, I woke up with a little thing thing going on. But I'm better now. Hopefully, my cramps will stay at the minimum. Um, but anyway, that's what I'm about to do now. Head downstairs, put the baskets together. My bitch, give me a new and hide your bodies. Hey, you go ahead and me. Ain't no problem. I don't got nobody just with you right now. But the truth, I look better under you. I'm 
ride with you, I feel like Scarface. Like that boy, bitch, with the bob, I'll be your main one. Just chase this argument back up to my place. Sexual mind, you on the violin on your day one. We had shit, yeah. It was magic, yeah. Smash and grab shit, yeah. Last grab was sick of hoe when you not it. Ain't a home when you not it. I'm the groom when you not it. I'm saying. I'm done their baskets they were all happy i was trying to show you guys but they were so excited they just grabbed the baskets so <clears throat> yeah i'm about to just spend the rest of the day with the kids and relax because i'm not really feeling too well and i'm gonna make me some tea relax and try to take a pill or something because at first it wasn't hitting me as much but now it's starting to hit me so all right, you guys, I'm going to end this video off by saying make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And thank you guys for tuning in to another one of my videos. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, y'all.